<laughs> I really wish you had told me that you was watching this. I would have gladly opted out. Talk about jaw dropping How long action. we got? Yo, what's going on, you guys? This is your boy RBG, aka the Random Black Gamer, here with my lovely wife Janet Lee on the ones and twos, and this is where we see the reactions, the place where we react to everything we never seen. And today we ain't reacting to no shows; we're reacting to a video game. We are going to be doing a reaction to all the fatalities of Mortal Kombat One. Yeah, boy, we already Mortal watched. Mortal Kombat One. Yeah, Mortal Kombat One, the newest game. It's called Mortal Kombat 1, even though I think it's like Mortal Kombat 12 or something like that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know, we enjoyed the cutscenes on there, man. We like how they've just revitalized these characters and just added something new to them. You know, especially my man uh, Kenshin. You know, I, I really like how his character lost his eyes and stuff. And Johnny finally gave him back that million dollar sword. I wouldn't have did it, but that's just me. You know, everything played out as it should. And we got a chance to see that reenactment of Mortal Kombat Armageddon. I still wish somebody would have got stole off on though. You know what I'm saying? Like snuck one good time. But hey, it is what it is, man. Yeah, I have been wanting to see these, but I was kind of uh, apprehensive about doing so because we know YouTube isn't too high on any Mortal Kombat content, especially when it comes to the graphical gore and violence that it pro uh, produces. So why are we posting it? We're posting it because people always find these ways of bypassing it. One thing that YouTube's algorithm hates, or it's it's uh, whatever search engine and everything else hates, is when it's all actual blood and stuff like that. But as we know, Mortal Kombat consists of different characters from the Nether Realms, some of which include like aliens and uh, reptiles. Which this person right here, um, if I got his name, what's his name? Uh, CRJ Gaming. He came up with the brilliant plan of utilizing Reptile to be the uh, one to get these fatalities performed on. And since Reptile isn't a human and has green blood, it's not necessarily like... Look at you being smart. Right. So I don't think this is going to get age I was not ready either because, you know, I don't like no blood and no gore. And I was about to hit him with the... <laughs> right. She's going to go Kotaro. Shit, I was about to hit him with the fan. I didn't know what the hell he was looking at today, and I just, not that. I don't do blood and gore. I don't do that. Yeah, it's like they always use these different characters. Like, I think they use Devora, like this chick that can utilize insects. Like, she has, like, blue blood. It always reminds me of, like, a, a walking fruit gusher. And you got um, my man Reptile, who got that green blood, looking like that old school Shrek ketchup. You guys remember that Heinz ketchup that Shrek had with the green ketchup up in it? So, yeah, that's what we're going to watch, man. When did they do the blue ketchup? You just reminded me of a childhood memory. I've forgotten about it. I, I forgot. I think they did that a few years after the Shrek movie came out because they realized that people just liked the different ketchups and they came out with blue and purple and stuff. Mm -hmm. And then you had that crazy woman that fun with the bag with the pink sauce. So, yeah, man. But anyways, we're going to go ahead and do this, man. This is going to be all fatalities. Mortal Kombat 1. So, let's do it. Mm. Ooh, okay, that nigga doing the uh disgusting. the T Hawk. Shit. Where he come from? Right? He just jumped out of nowhere and said, I'ma take I'ma take the credit. I didn't even do anything. I think that's because they got the partners, they got the cameo system up in this. <gasps> Damn. I don't even know how these characters continue to scream when they've been fatally wounded like that. Do you want to rematch or not? No, I'm just playing. <laughs> I, I, I should have pressed start. Should have bought a seven. <laughs> <laughs> kind of puts me in the mind of Ninja Scroll. Who is that? His granddaddy? I think that's his brother, Behan. Or Quiet Yang or something. Damn. What? I like how he slide in like what I miss. It's like y'all finish it? Even with the green blood, these are pretty graphic. Yeah, Nether Round Studios can piece. Shit. How? <laughs> uh, he just comes grooving right? on over. Looks like I was just about to snack bar. 
That was tight. All right, classic one right here. Can you select these? <laughs> okay. That's a classic with a twist right there. What did it look like? That damn Nicholas Cage character. <laughs> Which Nicholas Cage character? The one on the motorcycle. Oh, Ghost Rider? Yeah. Damn. That's unfortunate. Some spicy rotel dip right there. It's like when your food consumes you instead of you consuming it. Damn, he got about 59 of them. Hell yeah, that's Chang Soon, man. You know he got to come with that soul-sucking shit. Oh, okay, that's what that is. Well, I still think that was... Oh, my God. The fuck? Shit. <laughs> that was tight. Hey, selfie. <laughs> Bruh. Hey. <That's> nice. <laughs> got me the hearts. Is getting you got that on live stream? Yeah, I guess. <laughs> mm. Ooh, not the, not the car. Come on now. The Lambo, bro. Drop the top on this bitch. <laughs> Send my nigga to West Coast Customs. Hey. Your wife just come out of nowhere. Reporting for booty, I mean duty. I remember seeing this one in the trailer. This is about to be very unfortunate. See, how is he still screaming when his body has already been dismembered like that? I think you're actually... Something about... I don't know. I was going to try to make it make sense. I don't know. <laughs> it's like, I guess his body... Or he's screaming before everything happens. And, he, you know, his body hasn't registered it yet. Wow. Just put him in the space-time continuum. Right? That's some otherworldly shit for your ass. That's like some Requiem shit right there. They got Luke Kane like he a stand user. Right. <laughs> <laughs> the way this, that sound happens before they do the fatalities almost sounds like the beginning of bad. Right. Okay, Magic Chef. Mm. Man, that was cold. I always thought Keanu Reeves could play this character when he was younger. Shoot, he probably still could. Damn. It's like, I can't see the shit anyway. I might as well go all out. <laughs> Raiden. You know, he gonna deep fry him some organs. Yeah. Damn. Epic combo. He like he just came from the Nickelodeon Awards and that shit on his body. <laughs> yeah, Nickelodeon slime is a little bit more light green. Than that yeah, though. this this the darker one. This the infant mature Nickelodeon. Yeah, you almost showed his prized possession down there. All right, classic move. I'm gonna need to listen to me some gospel music and drink me some holy water when this is done. <laughs> ching, ching, ching. How? Right. <laughs> just honestly, how? Oh, it's like they just defy the laws even more. Like every time. Oh, okay. There you go, the classic one. Let me take you something real quick. Hey. Shit. Rogue ain't got shit on him. I thought you loved me. Right. My money got his clothes. All right, you gonna do it on yourself? Ooh. Wow! So you just gonna eat the booty like groceries, huh? This nigga need to take his ass to the Amazing Spider-Man. He look just like the Lizard Brother.
Damn. This is how you know this is not my cup of tea right here. <laughs> I'm starting to get a little too roast out. I love it. I don't. <laughs> I rebuke it in Jesus' name. What have you? Really? Yeah. Really? So are you going to play a game of operation like that? That's creative. He can live without a heart or some shit. Hey, this nigga can take off his limbs and beat you with it. <laughs> There's nothing to him. How? His dick is that strong? That was his shin. I know, but how could his dick break his shin, though? Hey, nigga pop lock with that shit. <laughs> oh, you talking about the green dude? That's yeah, the it's like he lock. kicked the, like, the dude's nuts and it broke his shin bone. Mm. I feel so bad for this poor character. <laughs> I really wish you had told me that you was watching this. I would have gladly opted out. Talk about jaw dropping How long action. we got of this crap? Luckily, it's only like 20 minutes long. Oh, Lord. Why do I get high? Go ahead and pass this shit. I love how he just Scorpion just comes grooving up all slow. Like, let me get some of that pose action right quick. Ooh. This fatality is no sponsored way. by Liquid Death. <laughs> you know he clean. Wow. That was just unnecessary. Boy said Moses ain't got nothing on him. That was unnecessary. <laughs> Put swag on this shit though. <laughs> wow. Oh my god. <laughs> How unfortunate for him and his family. <laughs> Boy. I know he always come with them ignorant fatalities. Oh, that kind of feels like Mortal Kombat 10's fatality right there. Now, everybody else then had somebody different, but he got himself. <laughs> well, you know there are two different uh, Kong Laos, though. Uh, so you have this... I guess Sub-Zero had two of him. Yeah. So there's just two of a bunch of people, huh? Yeah, like, I think, like, he has an ancestor that won the first Mortal Kombat tournament. Mm-hmm. And then they have a second generation. He didn't put the hat back on. He didn't need to. Why does it sound like me getting a whooping? <laughs> <laughs> Damn. <laughs> yeah. I was afraid that these second characters like Hype Man or something. Sheesh. Okay. We're done. Do the hokey pokey with it. We're done. Turn There's yourself around. <laughs> Melina. Mmm. Trouble guts. Wow, she just ripped my man torso off. His chest cavity. A series of uh, quite unfortunate events. <laughs> Tug of war. That's tough. Damn, I ain't gonna lie. That one right there was filthy. <laughs> it was actually a pretty simple one, too. It was. It was like simple yet efficient. I wasn't expecting that either. But Baraka. I thought he was going to do something else. Could have had a little bit more creativity no, they didn't even to that need one. To. They didn't even need to. All right, what you got for me this time? All right. <laughs> he said, my niggas got to eat too, shit. Over a campfire? Bruh. That was pretty close, though. <laughs> that was. <laughs> Real funny if Kano just came down there and lit the fire with his eyeball. <laughs> and she was my wife. 
Who is your mommy? Shit, the beehive ain't got shit on her. She probably got all kind of followers that's ready to just ride for her. No, I don't think so. Shit. That's when they know they can get their ass ripped apart. No she ain't nothing but Beyonce. Look how she's screaming and singing. No, Beyonce actually sounds good when she's singing. It's like, just think about what her rendition of Drunken Love would be like. Are you trying to get us canceled? <laughs> you know Beyonce fans ain't got no sense. Bring it. No. Don't. Quick. Please don't. <laughs> All right, Ashra. <laughs> I swear he does it in every fatality. Okay, some demon woman. Right, she's sanctified. This one is. Who is that, Doja Cat? Right? <laughs> That's what it looked like. Goddamn she devil. The last of a truth. For real. Compels and rips you, nigga. What's we'll here? Hey. Nigga Morris Chestnut. <laughs> <laughs> Say he gonna get cocker lacking this time. Wow, they would put Jax with him. Right. Ah, they just <laughs> had to put the two black people. Right. <laughs> the hell? Was that him from the past or something? Grab your own head from the past and beat the hell out of you with it. That was tight. That's the best one. That's the best one. <laughs> that's it. That I don't know what else you can Bruh. do to top that. That's that's it. That was clean. I love that. That, that <laughs> that's the best one. I'm sorry. It's about time. Literally. <laughs> it was about time. Damn. Okay, Rico. Or Rico, whatever your name. I know people always make fun of you, but damn. I'm gonna show you how to do the Macarena, <laughs> baby. Let's go. Face down, ass up. Pull your spine out your butt. Look at the nigga hands. <laughs> My boy been collecting all the W's that I having to do anything. Hey. <gasps> Sheesh. <laughs> Where you come from? Who is that? I don't even know. Like they just grab some dude from an old kung fu film or something. <laughs> Yeet! Hey. I like how he just do the spin around. I know. I like how he matched with her though. Right? He did that. He might be zaddy or something. Put it in reverse, Terry. Oh yeah, they put it in reverse already. Right. <laughs> Got Woody Harrison with him. Ooh. Yeah, she made this nigga's arms explode by poking his nipples. The hell was that? A dragon? Ooh. Lord. <laughs> <laughs> Nether realm. How do y'all sleep at night making these? That's kind of basic. That's classic. That's what look like Ghost Rider. Yeah. Hey, okay, so this must be a cameo finisher. The time you did something, nigga. Right, he been Shit. standing there on a lot of them. Literally slide on the ops. Hey, my nigga. Mr. Mustard himself. A lot of characters wear yellow in this. Yeah, they do. <laughs> <laughs> I wonder if that was his friend saying, no, nigga. What the fuck is you doing? <laughs> he said, look. He's like, you said go you out with a bang, right? <laughs> Hey, it's still pumping. <laughs> oh, nice. So, yeah, cameo finishers. <laughs> hey. I kind of like the basic ones. I'm not going to lie. Yeah, these are just kind of like callbacks. I can uh, appreciate that. A cinematic twist. 
Damn, I don't think I've ever seen him use his tail. Damn. Wins. Hell yeah, it's my boy. <laughs> oh, that's the old Chang song. I forgot. When he disguised himself. I thought it was him. Yeah. It's like, y'all gonna buy my damn potions and shit, Y'all gonna buy my CDs. <laughs> Sell them out the trunk. I was just about to say, sell them out the <laughs> trunk to feed my kids. Y'all gonna buy my CDs. Damn. Okay, that's how you feel? Shout wins. I like how they left the con off because he's not a con in this game. Mm -hmm. Hey, Terry Crews wins. <laughs> okay, Doja Cat, let's see right. what you got. The hell? Was that a. Alright. I can. I, 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 I dig that one. That's alright. <laughs> hey, Johnny Cage. That was very nice and simple. I like that. Yeah. I mean, I don't like it, but I mean. Very basic, but classic. Yeah, Mr. Clamp shot himself. <laughs> oh, man. Catch up. You better do that. Oh, hey, shit. Hey, girl, Frostbite or Frost? My mommy still loves to play her. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Damn. Damn. <laughs> That's kind of knocking all my man gains off. That, yeah, <laughs> emasculated him. This dude, police brutality, or should I say fatality? <laughs> really? <laughs> she come in with a cartwheel. He just turned around like, yeah, I did it. <laughs> all right? It's like, yeah, don't be checking out my ass. Oh, I love this one. <laughs> That's like nigga gave me that that Tim tality right there with them Tims. Whew, man, it's finally over. <laughs> it is done for. <laughs> that was all the fatalities to Mortal Kombat One, man. It seems like with each era and each graphical improvement, the creators always try to take it to a next level with these things, you know. And this one right here, I don't know. I feel like it's kind of like a toss-up, which is when I like the most between Mortal Kombat Eleven or this, you know. Like obviously, this one right here looks graphically better, even some, even though some people will argue that it doesn't, but. You know, I like how they were, um, they use more cinematic angles and stuff like that. And it seems like they love just like blowing up the upper half of the body in this one right here. They love tearing the fucking arms off, okay? Tearing the arms off and the torso and the spine. They love ripping it out of yeah, the body. Yeah, the they love doing that shit. Yeah, you know, I don't know if they just go to like real videos for reference to see what looks the real more realistic or what that's but, unfortunate yeah i would hope to, that that's not the case i would i would hope not i would hope that's not the case either but it's just like they take it to these next like these gruesome levels and stuff some of which you know like even though these are insane and impossible to pull off on somebody it's like practicality isn't really like a thing that they oh, no. just take into consideration no <laughs> <laughs> like Most Katana's, of these are very, very not practical, not practical at all. Yeah, like Katana's little fans, the way they're spinning, I guess they're kind of creating this polarity, which keeps the person in the air and stuff. But the way they were like grinding it down, you know, made no sense at all. <laughs> but I mean, and again, like you said, these are so impractical, none of these make sense at all. Yeah, which one um, was that that we had uh popped over? I think it was Garrus. Like this guy right here who's basically like the keeper of time or something. That time, dude, <laughs> fatality where he pulled his head off, slapped him with it, and then reached back in time. And it, that was the one. That was the one. Yeah, this one right here, it kind of reminds me of Injustice 2's Flash's uh, finisher because like, you know, Injustice is made by this, this company that does this game right here, except it's, you know, mild when it comes to finishers. Like where the Flash essentially grabs his enemy and runs like through different times like 
he slams his enemy into like a I think like a pyramid and then slams him into like a dinosaur <laughs> and then runs back and slams him into himself like his past self they got you know I guess yanked it's like they just slam to each other and the other flash grabs the one that he slammed him into and just takes off running you know it's like this time continuing thing that's what it kind of puts me in the mind of this one right here you know like that whole thing with time and stuff it's just very interesting like the only thing I don't like about this character he was more yoked up in the previous version but they kind of slimmed him down for this one <laughs> you know what I'm saying I was just saying he was very imposing up in the last game but this one he's just kind of more leaned out you know like he they found out he was on some kind of like sand steroids or something you know but he still looks good though and I like how the cameo characters were able to utilize their finishers you know because we haven't seen these finishers in so long since they debuted back in like the 32 and 16 bit era you know so it was cool to see them use those old school finishers for the cameo characters overall if i were to rate these i would give this one a solid s i really enjoyed myself with this like I say, I'm all about the gory stuff. You know, I'm just completely desensitized when it comes to this shit. You know, AI has taken over and many people believe certain things that they see that are stripped of uh, taken directly from games and stuff, you know. And they're able to pass it off as realistic. So, yeah, I really enjoyed this one. What would you rate it? I rate this as you for unfortunate. <laughs> you for unfortunate? Yep, it's going to you for unfortunate. Um, just all the way around unfortunate. Okay, would you say that they were creatively unfortunate? They were horrifically unfortunate. Horrifically unfortunate. I like it. But yeah, guys, that's going to do it for us today, man. We hope you enjoyed this reaction because, as always, we have a blast reacting to these things with you and for you. If there's anything we may have missed or gotten misconstrued throughout this crazy chaos and bloodiness, let us know in the comment section below. But this is your boy RBG, my lovely unfortunate wife, Johnny Lee. No, I, I'm fortunate. Okay. No, I'm fortunate. Those were unfortunate, but unless you, you try to tell me something. You weren't fortunate enough to watch this, though. No, I was unfortunate enough to have to exactly. watch this. Exactly. So you were unfortunate no, enough. No, but I am fortunate. But you, my unfortunate, well, my fortunate uh, wife, Johnny. <laughs> we didn't see the reactions. We'll see you guys next time. Peace out.